So how do we confirm the diagnosis, right? So obviously isolating the virus, it is not easy. It's only done for research purposes. What we practically do is in the, <clears throat> in the first five to six days of illness, we should, uh, either we can do a, uh, uh, we can demonstrate specific viral antigen or the RNA of the virus, right? So RNA of the virus, we can do a polymerase chain reaction that is dengue PCR. Okay, or the, we can demonstrate specific viral antigen. What is commercially is, uh, uh, easily available test is something called dengue NS1 antigen test. That is in the first five to six days of illness. After first to five, 60 days, these antigen levels come down, comes down, why the virus level comes down and the body starts mounting antibodies in response to dengue infection. After five to six days, if a, in a person with, uh, infected with dengue, we should be able to demonstrate antibodies against dengue virus. Okay, so <clears throat> if it's in the, after five, six days of onset of fever, it is the dengue IgM antibodies. Okay, uh, which, which can be an ELISA method. Okay, uh, or in the early phase, what is commonly used is NS1 antigen. Uh, the PCR test, if it is available, you could use that. Virus isolation is very difficult. That is done only for research purposes, you know, in special special labs. So this is the graph, a beautiful graph, which uh, tells you what natural history of dengue is like. So here, the patient gets bitten by a mosquito. There is an incubation period where the patient does not have any symptoms. That's called incubation period, right? From the time the virus enters a patient's person's body till the time he manifests some symptoms. So then the patients start after three, four days. The incubation period is typically, you know, two to five days, two to seven days. After two, three days, the patient starts having uh, fever. The virus level goes up. Okay. So after four, five days, the fever comes down. The virus level comes down. And after this phase, most patients actually, after the initial febrile phase, they improve. They enter convalescent or, you know, resolution phase. But about less than 10% of patients, they actually enter critical phase of dengue where the fever comes down but the patient's clinical condition worsens. The platelets start dropping, they start having rash, they start having bleeding manifestations, BP may drop and other complications. So after four or five days, as the fever comes down, uh, the viremia comes down. After four or five days, the PCR will become negative, the antigen test will become negative, but the IgM test will start becoming positive, okay? And that's usually after five, six days after on stuffiness.